Noise is annoying, especially when traveling. When you need to pay attention to airport announcements, for example, noise is something you can do without. Trolley bags, children's laughter, footsteps, in the uninsulated acoustic of these huge halls, you get one big unpleasant fog of noise. The acoustic properties of a room, here at Freudenberg's Acoustic Hall at their site in Weinheim, determine how clearly we can make out speech and whether we can distinguish it from environmental noise. An example, you can barely make out the following sentence without sound absorption. Only with the right sound absorption do we be able to understand this announcement. By fixing perforated acoustic elements under the ceiling or to the walls, the reverberation time of the sound can be significantly reduced. Only with the right sound absorption can you understand this announcement in the acoustic hall. The difference in reverberation is related to the sound absorbing perforated acoustic elements. They're generally made of metal, wood or plasterboard, and they're backed with sound absorbing materials. Alternatively, you can use voluminous mineral fiber mats. But there are more elegant solutions, ultra-thin acoustic non-wovens, as produced by the Freudenberg Group from Weinheim, Germany, under the brand name Soundtex. The production method of the 0.27mm thick fabric is similar to that of paper. Cellulose and circuit fibers dissolved in water are poured onto a sieve. The water flows away, leaving the fibers behind. These are then bonded together with synthetic resin. The result is a textile-like random mesh which is very homogeneous and dense, yet remains porous. At 63 grams per square meter, the non-woven fabric is around 25% lighter than standard copy paper. Soundtex is dyed black, printed with its brand logo, and coiled onto huge rolls. 6,000 meters of fabric per roll, each weighing half a metric ton. But how does this acoustic non-woven achieve its results? In simple mechanics, when sound waves encounter a perforated panel, most are reflected. Exactly how many? depends on the number and spacing of the holes. Part of the sound slips through the holes and passes through the absorber fabric and is reflected by the concrete wall or ceiling. Now, air molecules that have been caused to vibrate by the noise rub against the fibers of the acoustic non-woven. As a result, their kinetic energy is transformed into heat and the noise is reduced. Although the environment at airports equipped with sound techs will never be totally silent, it will be much more pleasant. Even high-tech electronic systems can barely achieve better sound attenuation. This non-woven noise buster can absorb more than 75% of the penetrating sound.